Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to the Femboy Varia mod for Hearts of Iron 4. I'm your host, Mr. Femboy Lover. Right now, we are hanging out, and we're trying to make some immortality charms. In which, where are we at? Oh, we're over here. In which, yes, next year's socks will slow the aging process and help us use your Never Age You Day for 30. In which, right now, it's October 21st, 1939, and we are going to go with Cognitive Enhancer next. So, we'll increase the user's cognitive abilities, increasing both combat abilities and production skills. Ooh, and look at those socks. Oh, they're so nice. And then, with 1939, we'll give some research right there, done with that, that stuff. Uh, what do we need? Maybe better radar would be nice, even though I'm not sure if we're really going to build it up. We'll get these tries. We're trying to make more divisions before we do end up trying to go to war with the Germans, because I think that would be a good, excellent goal for us, just to see what happens. Now, just because, like, we get the pink empire, we apparently have to own Rio de Janeiro. Which literally makes no sense, but... And we need more than 59 military factories, but... Okay, whatever. Uh, okay, well, Japan joined... Oh, hello. France... J oh, Communist France. Oh. Why did they join the Allies? Look at this. We lose quite a bit more stability, but we get a lot more political power. Division organization. We get more attack as well. Look at that. The tier 5 socks. Those look pretty darn nice. Um, honestly, with that extra attack... We could probably, probably afford to get a little cuter. Open dating interface. Oh, we can do that as well. 75. Cuteness. Cuteness standards. Mass script production is always very good. Femboy Nation. Above average cuteness. Nice. Get some mechanized offensives. Go with a count. I don't know why we're going that way. We have no tanks. Why do you keep going that way? Whatever. But these guys are 40 count, with, with, which is pretty darn nice. Let's see. Ooh, since we're here anyway, it's going to get some research speed. That's fine. Uh, how, how, can, how can we go? Encourage. Oh, wait. Oops. Wrong one. I, I clicked on the wrong one. We have so much political power, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, it doesn't really matter too much. Tier 5 socks would be great. And Poland, Poland returns Danzig. Wow. Wow. Uh. Check on Taunt. So, is America fighting anybody? Oh, they're fighting... Oh, they're already fighting the Japanese? And, the f oh, well, that sucks for you, Doriot. Yeah, these guys joining the Guangxi clique. Which, you know, this is the Japanese. That's not too bad, especially since they don't have cores on this territory and land, so... <coughs> Maybe they'll have a chance of winning. But we've got some problems to go through, and who's this? Greater, Por Greater Portugal. I think it was Brazil. Wow. Tier 5 socks, please. Tier 5 socks. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. And which we still want to try the dating interface, but if we don't get it in this campaign, we'll try the next one as well. 85. Get some more cuteness. Because we can. And after 5 sucks. Infinite storage. Well, let's go ahead and do the flying femboys. Get some more air XP first. We're really out of guns and artillery. Claims on Yugoslavian territory. Half of you guys are going to switch over to be just straight femboys for now. That would be great. So, yeah, if these guys, the Germans end up, like, when we go to war with them, end up killing us off, well, we'll do the best we can. We'll do the best we can. Collaboration government in Austria? No, thank you, no, thank you. Out of flying femboys, we get some radar. Let's grab some of this as well. It is 1940. Happy 1940, everybody. Uh, flying femboys. Working conditions. Wouldn't be too bad. Anti air. Grab some of that as well. We could, could use some better fighters as well. Someone says, uh, stay away from the femboys. Yes. Tomboys. Not bad. But someone rec really he heavily recommends that we stay away from the femboys. <laughs> I'll get more defense from this too. That's actually really nice. Let's go with infinite storage. H oh, maybe not. That's 105 days. Holy crap. Well, let's go with the Bavarian plan. A better autarky. Well, oh, that's a, so much steel. Oh, uh, yeah. Honestly, we could use this steel. Let's go with a better autarky. Let's go with the better autarky for now. Nice. And then we'll go with uh, men and women. It's another 75 day, 70 day focus. Or 80. How cute can we get? It's always a question to ask. How cute can we become? Um, 60 maybe. Get some radar in here too. And get a thing of rubber just because we'll probably honestly need that later. Oh, someone else says this is a mod that embraces my radical far right beliefs. Absolutely. Absolutely. Nothing like Felix, the prime femboy, to get pumped to... Hmm... Yeah. Yeah. Cool. And someone says, we need to go with a democratic femboy sometime. Our future? Yeah, why not? Femboy Varia stands alone versus 
Union of European Femboys. I think that would be a lot of fun. That would be a lot of fun. And then why is Bavaria the Femboy Nation? Well, I think they had like a gay leader at one point, maybe, late 19th century. So that's probably why. And helps weaken Germany as well, especially when they go a little crazy. Oh, that sucks for the, those guys over there, but whatever. A fall of Hong Kong, that's good. And then someone also recommends, can we get Dilvanga, Dilvanga as a oh, Femboy? Femboy uh, Dilvanga? Yes, please. Average cuteness is 85, so get even more political power. We lose 5% attack, but that's okay since we did get plus 10% anyway, so we got plus 5% attack, period, and we get even more daily de compliance. Indian people, that's, that's a big civil war. Now, do they have any divisions? Oh, yeah, they're pretty equal. That's actually not, not too bad. That's not too bad for them. Lots of oil fields. Oh, we have 24 divisions. Nice. Yeah, this boy just make everyone. You're done. There you go. Boot artillery. Uh, get some better fighters if we can. Zelda is great and all, but... Oh. There you go. See what we can do about that. And then do that. And now we're out of guns and artillery, but that's pretty normal. That's pretty gosh darn normal for us. So who's going to be the next general? Pink Sun Gwendolyn. Izumi. Well, let's go with Pink Sun Gwendolyn for now. Give it to the British. It's fine, whatever. Of men and women. And then we'll probably go ahead and do... Raise a militia. Yeah. Because we do want to go to war eventually. We definitely need to go to war. What's the whole dating interface? Oh, Hirohito still exists for now. There's, there's a BP. Nice. Can you do it again? Except with open arms. So... Oh, U.S. is killing himself too. Ask on a date. A date with Hirohito! Oh, look at that! For the first time, Hiro Hirohito went all out. The two of you went on a tour of the Pacific on his pride of the fleet, the Yamato. All the staff made sure you and the Emperor received the most luxurious treatment possible. It did, however, feel a little weird having all the soldiers treat him like he was a god for future dates. You'd think you'd be making sure you stayed away from his military subordinates. American Civil War. Italy joined Japan. Constitutional... Yeah, Constitutional Group. Constitutional States of America. I'm sorry, man. That's... I don't know about that with FDR, but... Oh, Japan's over here, too. Look at that. Oh, there goes, there goes France. Oh. Bye, France. Hey, at least we got Hirohito kind of getting hot and bothered in the skin. I like getting hot and bothered, but whatever. No comments for me. What? Cool, cool, cool. Ooh. And we have a cup of coffee here to keep us nice and warm as well. Because what is a Hoi 4 episode without coffee? Disappointing, maybe. Just disappointing. Cool. And what is this one? Of men and women. Do we convert women to become femboys? Hmm. Tomboys. The rise in acceptance of feminine men in femboy Vari has had many strange consequences. One of these has been the unintentional rise of gender equality. For the time being, femboy. Femboy Vari will be the state where everyone contributes, especially when that contribution goes to war effort. Yay? Get more population and production cap. Nice. Nice. They're definitely going to need that soon. Especially with all these femboys running around here. Alright, get some more defense. That would be grand, grand, grand. Get some nuclear femboy magic. Uh, well, maybe not magic, but... Yeah, you know what I mean. How much political power do we get it? We get 3.5 a day. No wonder we have so much. Just go and do that too, then. Let's see your press censorship. Why not? We get so much PP, it doesn't even matter. So I would like to do the Pink Empire, but... Like I said, Owen oh, Rio, Indian People's Republic is a subject of Femboy Varia. I'll probably just have to use Khan's commands for that one. And after this one, honestly, we'll probably just go to war, straight to war with Germany. The Flying Femboy Concert, Advanced Research, University of Flying, force people to do stuff. Are we... Oh, we're only on limited conscription, that's fine. Tour buses, Supremacy of Skirts. Nice. The Tier 7 socks. Holy crap. So the goal is just to try to hold out against the Germans once we can produce enough equipment. Which I hope we can do some equipment. Uh, no, Hungary is not quite ready yet. Not quite. Yes. What is Germany up to? Are they going to go to war with us eventually? Uh-oh. Well, that's not good. Hungary wants to join. Bulgaria wants to join. I'm um, preparing to tell coup. Rekindle. Oh. Poland. 
Uh... Wow. Actually, that's really good. Look at that. Wow. If anything, honestly, we might just join the, the Japanese faction just because Mussolini probably is a femboy. So, but, oh, that's not good, man. That's not good. Yeah, it's a good thing we took out Hungary already. <laughs> and Czechoslovakia, I hope they say no. We're guaranteeing the independence. Ooh. Not bueno. Key lessons, yeah. Get some more cuteness. That'll be good. Gender equality. Oh, how many more balls? That's good. Yes. And nothing for the Navy, which I don't know why. So there's a comment saying, why, why am I researching naval stuff? Because I can. Just because I can. Um, to roll? Ah, uh, yes. Eventually, build up this stuff once we run out of things to build. Yeah, sweep it, sweep it, a wee bit of rubber, a wee bit, just a wee bit. Cool. China is doing better against Japan, which sucks. Uh oh, are we gonna have a Soviet Union civil war? But the fanboy militias. The fanboy Bible may preach peace, but when it's the cuteness itself that is threatened, then it is every boy's duty to defend all that is wholesome. His his cuteness, the fem boat. Has called a crusader to claim the cutie lands from the infidels, who would deny kittens their right to visit the wholesome places. It's time for the armies of femboism to put aside their differences and unite under one banner, the sign of thigh highs, and give go back God's children what is rightfully theirs or die trying. Hoo hoo hooray hoo hoo. <laughs> oh, we get nine more divisions, nice. Alright, so with that, so we're basically done with this part of the treaty except for that thing. So let's go up here and do force people to do stuff, because we love forcing them to do stuff against their will. Hmm. Hmm. So we did get claimed, so we might as well start justifying on these guys now. And if Italy's going to do really well and be actually be able to hold here, it'd be really nice, first of all. The American Junta passes the War Powers Act. I hate the American Civil War. That's why I've never done it. It's I think it's just stupid. We're fighting Douglas MacArthur? What? What? They went fascist? How how? I get that they're, they're probably not trying to get the second Confederate States, but like Bro. Bro. Seriously. Bro. <laughs> Gonna use more millies, too. Catholic. Oh, look at the Catholic Mexico. I should play as Mexico. I've never played as Mexico really on, in Hoi 4. Then again, you look at this focus screen, it's like, oh, it's, it's, it's alright. Center Kiss Youth. Yeah, this is definitely better to do that one. Cute lessons, we are max, maxed out on the cuteness. I'm gonna grab one of those because we can. Nice. Oh. I mean, I, I really don't think we're re really ready yet. Support weapons are nice though. Can't get any cuter? Oh yeah, today in a rather ordinary day without any holiday whatsoever. People seem so wholesome. Rows of cute boys flow the streets in hot pink skirts and thigh highs. Not to mention uh, the overly exposing tank tops that seem to be in fashion nowadays. Honestly, everyone seems so cuddly worthy nowadays that the urge to nuzzle the male populace seems to hard to contain. Ooh, so cute, much lovely. <laughs> Tour buses. Jesus. Netherlands join the Allies. That's fine. Whatever. Honestly, I want these guys to finish off first, and then. Oh, that was really fast. Support companies. Sure, why not? Um, Greater Portugal join the join them too. Pakistan join the UK. Oh, well, that makes sense. Oh. Hello. Uh. Mm, I'm gonna say no for now. I wanna give us just a little bit more time. We just need a few more artillery pieces. Just a few more. Not a lot more. Just a few more. I think we'll be okay with our population. Especially since we're mobilizing more anyways. And we can always raise conscription a little bit more as well. So. Nagisa. Attack and def attack. I would like more defense. Not bad. Not bad either. A lot of this stuff is pretty good. Recruitable population factor wouldn't be too bad either. Uh, national idol is not bad for more attack. So, supremacy of sparkles. We'll probably ooh, glitter cannons. Oh, we get even more war sport. Oh, it'll be so nice. I just don't know if we'll actually be able to hold. So, you know what? Let's save the game. We'll try it anyways. Screw it. If it doesn't go well for us, then we'll probably go somewhere else. Can you actually push in it anywhere? That'd be kind of nice. Germany under attack. Oh. 
Okay, well, whatever. See what you can do. As long as Czechoslovakia's not called in, because they're in the uh, little Entente, but still. Yeah, you probably want to hold. And now they're attacking us. Ooh, why, are you why did you lose so fast? Wow, that is not bueno. Uh, here you go. Do that. Yeah, it's not going to be great here. Just win here, Italy. Please win here. I don't want you to lose, lose, lose. But, like, see what we can do. Minus 2,000 is not terrible. We're doing better than I thought we would. Oh, crap. It is going to go crazy. Once we start losing here... Oh, you know what? Just just in case. Just just retreat. Sports company is nice. Let's go ahead and grab some infinite storage. Let's we'll store an infinite amount of belongings without ruining their appearance. God, that'd be so nice. Let me just walk in here. We need to... We really need to hold our line here. Yeah. Yeah, no. Don't worry about that. Oh, hello. Well, that's not good. Get a lot of experience, uh, Felix. I'm sure Felix has a lot of experience. There goes Greece. Yeah, this is gonna... Wow, look how weak those guys are. Oh, no. No. Absolutely not. Augsburg is ours. War bonds. Uh, war propaganda would be nice, but still. Improved anti-air. What? The Soviets don't want to help us out? What? Logistics. Um, is there anything here that could really help us out immediately? Honestly, probably not. We've lost 34,000, which is basically nothing to those guys over there, but whatever. Don't worry about attacking, just don't lose too much. Just hold the god dang line. Doesn't help that they have Soviet volunteers as well, but still. Pop them out as fast as you can. Get them out. We need more more divisions on the line. Wait, what? Wait, so Qing China joined those. So if we join the Japanese faction, we'll be fighting the Czechs too then. God dang it. Come on, Italy. Do the best you can. Hopefully these guys are learning something though. Oh, that's not good. That's so not good. No, 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 no. Are you kidding me? Seriously. God dang it. I hope the Soviet Union explodes. Yeah, it's not great. I'm not sure we're supposed to actually fight Germany itself, but, you know, we're trying. Well, we're cheating over the river. That's fine. Hold the line, hold the line. Don't lose Augsburg. <clears throat> You're literally not allowed to lose it. Uh, seriously, what? Go, get back in there. Doesn't know that we don't have air superiority either. It's probably the biggest reason why we're losing. How are we losing here, though? We're literally fighting over a river. What? We got better defenses than them, than them too. Seriously, bro? Seriously? And there's nothing we can do about that, huh? Get out of here, you pieces of garbage. We have enough guns, though, which is good. But still. Getting a little dicey around here. You know what? What about level 1 forts? Yeah, we already have some forts around here. No. 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 Get your butts back in there. Better radars. Good. Um, yeah, there's not really much we can do. We can throw in some military police. That can really help us out that much. We can get some better artillery already. It's already December. Might as well, right? Oh my god. You're... Why? How are you losing? How are you losing? Bro, come on. Germany. Wilhelm. Come on, man. Yeah. 
I'll probably do some funky console stuff off screen to make sure that we can do okay ish here. As much as we want to win, I don't think Bavaria, united with Austria and Hungary, really stand up against a big old, basically, World War I Germany. Casualty wise, 100,000 versus 103,000. And probably a lot of dead Soviet boys, too. Yeah, no. How? Air superiority, that's why. Come on, infinite storage. Oh, artillery's getting so much worse. Oh my god. Yeah, we need Germany to go to so war with someone else. Uh, yeah, they, the Soviets need to fight the Germans or something here. Proud of modern Germany? Hmm. Oh, the Czech on town's doing really well, actually. Can we join your faction? Actually, can we join the Allies faction? No, because we're fascists. Darn it. We were set up to fail here. Man. Well, we'll go as far as we can. And I'll do some funky stuff off screen to see what it's like. Get out of here, Germany. You cannot fight anyone else. Actually, that's not bad. If they, especially if these guys join like the allies or something. You, Iraq join the Chinese United Front. All right, that's weird. Very weird. They say they're out of, they're running out of stuff, but I don't believe them. Oh, they're out of manpower. Oh, that's good. My man. Oh my god. Yeah, without air superiority, you're kind of, you're just kind of screwed. Yeah, that kind of sucks, bro. Are we still mobilizing? Yeah, we are. That's not bad. War economy. Probably total mobilization. But then again, we're running out of spaces, spaces to build here. There's not really much we can really do. I want to see what, does this give us anything? If not, then I'm probably just going to do the pink empire. Because we need cores. We can't have everything. I'll probably just complete a lot of this off, off screen just because there's really nothing else we can do. So, let's see what this one does when we complete it together first. Just because, as much as, as many buses we get, you can't compete against the German Empire. You just cannot compete. How is Italy losing to Yugoslavia? How? So bad. No, this, was, this is literally suicide for us. No, Japan. I'm glad I didn't accept them earlier. Come on, Germany, you wanted this war. You wanted to have no femboys here. Alright. Infant storage. And? Does that give us anything? I don't, I don't think it really does. Cool. It doesn't really do anything for us. So, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to probably just do this off screen. I'll just use cons commands, probably, just because. Why not? Supremacy of skirts. Interception, insanity, CO recreational planes, boom, uh, navy with no ships, university of flying, the flying femboy concert, advanced research, oceans exist, Let's throw someone in the water, figure out what ships are good, uh, explosions, rule the waves, protect the stock trade, the pink empire, build in, built in rocket launchers, cool, uh, flight capabilities, tier six socks. Hurts our stability even more, hurts the consumer goods, but even more organization. They get a lot more tech. Infinite comfort. Beyond what is what thought's impossible. Plasma fields. Teleportation chips. And then tier 7 socks. So I'll see you in a little bit after I've done a couple of this. Hello everyone, after using just a few console commands, just a few of them, well, I've completed the focus street just because we can, and basically we are now in Germany. We've basically uh, beat them up. Uh, totally didn't uh, do anything funky to the German divisions, just to see what would happen. Yeah, this being you know, on a historical, not great, but at the same time, oh well. Just because you know this is a basically a meme mod, as you can probably tell by now. Um, so, I, I, using cons commands, I don't really care at this point. 
At this point on my channel, I'm like, if I have to, I have to. And trying, Bavaria trying to hold out by itself against Germany, probably not going to win. But, oh well. But guys, I've got what's level 6, level 4, level 4, not bad, not bad. Pretty good on attack for Zelda. Zelda? Question mark? So, at this point, I'm just like, whatever, I'm just going to take everything. Why not? Yeah, this has turned into a very, 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 very weird world. So, there we are, the Fem Bavarian Empire. So right now, oh, there goes Belgium. Um, we don't, of course, in Poland, but that's pretty much it, which is... Okay. I wish there was a little bit more here. We get cuteness factor. Oh, yeah. Can we date... Oh! Wait, Vargas came back. Look at that. Hirohito? Give 100... Oh. Nice. We do that three times. Can we ask on a date? Back with Hirohito! You and Hirohito both met at a cafe for a second date. Hirohito talked about a lot of random political stuff. Stupid opposition figures. And how silly some of their citizens could be. You sat and laughed, uninterested in what they were saying, but happy to be happy to be someone to talk to. Very wholesome, very wholesome. Uh, can we max out our hearts with a Hirohito? That's like that's the end goal. Killing and cheating to kill Germany is not the end goal here. No, the end goal is to date Hirohito. Our end goal is always to date Hirohito. So we got a lot of PP. Let's see if we can use it. Hirohito, success. Perfect. Do it one more time. Here, here's a lot of mediums. Nice. One final date. It was time for one final date with Daddy Hirohito. You both met on a beautiful island. He said that even he'd give it to you as a gift. You blush and gladly accept this new land to start a Japanese collaboration government in him. You talked for hours, but the entire time it seemed like there was something he wanted to tell you. Every word had another hidden behind it. His thoughts seemed to scramble around whatever he was truly trying to say, and then, as the sun began to rise, he finally said, I want to make you the Empress of Japan. What? <clears throat> Yes. I want to make you the Empress of Japan. I know it's a little out there, but I think it would be really cool. It took a few more hours for him to explain exactly what he meant, but in the end, you thought it was really nice of him to want to give you a cool title like that. What? What? You actually get bonuses around? Oh. Empress of Japan. Now we get more attack and just by World Goals times. Attack went in combat along the side, alongside the pride of the fleet. What? We got Catboy, Dictator, Slick. Dapper, irresistible, experienced diplomat, brown haired king, and then Empress of Japan. Okay, yeah, using cause commands, I don't know. I think it's still, I think it's still the right thing to do while wow, 10 days is not bad. Just because this is a historical and it got, it's, this got really flippin' funky. But hey, I think that's going to be the end of this this particular campaign. Let me know in the comments below. Should we do the Lord Regent sometime and do Bavaria, our beloved, versus Strike at Germany, which we'll probably do eventually, maybe. We'll see what happens. Or should we do our Path to Freedom? And we do the Nagasas or Hidera's Hidera's victory. Segregation of non fem boys. Equality among citizens, but hey, let me know if we should go down either route. But regardless, I hope you enjoyed this very, very weird femboy campaign. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link like normal in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching, and have a very, very intense, raw femboy rest of your day.